Yes, sir. Monday, meaning head coach Frank Wilson is gracious enough to spend some time with us. Coach, three in a row. Yeah. Three wins in a row, and you get the first road win uh, of 2018. Let me, when I say that, let me qualify that. I saw going in that you guys were being questioned about, hey, you guys haven't won on the road yet. Mm -hmm. Well, I went back and I was like, yeah, but the two road games previously came against Baylor and Case, I mean, not Baylor, K-State and Arizona State. A lot of teams would be 0-2 when those are your right. two first road games. Right. So to finally get a road win in Houston had to feel pretty darn good on Saturday. It felt great. It felt great. Not only that it was a road win, but that it was against that opponent. You know, contrary to popular belief, besides two years ago, uh, we've only won once in, in, at Rice. And so to go back in that venue for the second out of three years uh, and get a victory on the road in a conference game was a big deal for us. It's one of those types of games where you throw the records oh, out yeah. the window, right? I mean, it's conference yeah, it's, uh, rivalry, it's Houston, it's San Antonio. <coughs> I mean, it's, it, it's one of those games where on that given day, and it is going to happen, you guys came out on the right end on yeah, Saturday. Yeah, certainly. I, I, I just think our team played extremely hard. I thought they played extremely determined. Uh, and found a way to uh, to win a football game. If you look at highlights, someone might say, okay, maybe maybe not the prettiest yeah. game played, but <clears> at <throat> this point, especially when you get into conference play, it doesn't matter. A, yeah, a you, W is a W. Yeah, you take it however you can get it. Uh, certainly you always strive for more. You reach for the stars. But at the end of the day, it doesn't matter what happens. Uh, when that time expires, you know, the W is what counts. Circling back to the getting the win <clears throat> on the road, how big is that from whether it's a psyche standpoint, just whatever it might be for the team to get a win away from home? Yeah, I think it's a big deal. I think it's a big deal because you'll have to go on the road yet again. Uh, we've proven we can play well in our venue to go on the road and to earn a conference victory, uh, knowing that at the back end here you still have to go on the road yet again to earn victory is, uh, is something for, from a mental standpoint that was important for our team. And you come back home now. Don't have to worry yeah. about uh, the road this coming <laughs> week. Homecoming mm -hmm. and a tough Louisiana Tech team yeah. awaits you there at the Dome. Very talented football team on, on both sides of the ball uh, that – uh, premieres the um, top defensive end in, in our conference, uh, one of the top defensive ends, Jalen Ferguson in the country. Uh, right now, the active leader in sacks, uh, 33 and a half sacks, more than anyone in the country, a projected preseason second round draft pick. Uh, Marcus Davenport-ish, if you will, mm -hmm. for our conference. Yeah. A very talented young man. Uh, they return all four of their guys up front. They're really good in the secondary. They return both backers. Uh, they throw the ball all over the yard uh, and have some talented receivers that can make plays. So um, we'll, we'll, we look forward to this game. Are they, because they're competitive year in and year out, yeah. are they kind of a measuring stick? Are they yeah. always one of those kind of Conference USA kind of standard bear type teams? Yeah, I think so. You, you, you have to, especially over the, the last six years with Skip Holtz there. They've been at the top echelon of, of Conference USA West for sure and have positioned themselves every year in going to bowl games and in consideration for conference championships. Um, and so, uh, you know, other teams have had a year or so, but uh, consistently they've been the team. And so, uh, you know, to, to, to be the best, you got to go try to beat the best. And uh, consistently over the last six years, they've been arguably the best team in Conference USA was. Can't let you go without asking you quickly yeah. about a couple of guys who were on that field for that Cowboys-Texans yeah. game last night that you recruited. Yeah. Lyle Collins and then for the Texans, Honey Badger and Alfred Blue. Yeah, um, so Alfred Blue and, and Tyron Matthews, uh, same class, same recruiting class. Lyle Collins, the year later, a year later, all part of the fam. Yeah. Uh, so it was good to see those guys compete in, uh, in a hard fought game that went all the way down to the wire. Yeah. Overtime is what it took in a field goal at that. Coach, appreciate the time. Best of luck on homecoming on Saturday. Thanks so much for having me. You're watching Sports Tonight, San Antonio's only nightly 30 minute sports cast with exclusive sports coverage you won't find anywhere else.